Right, and for the final fight of the night, and what's been a huge and exciting night of fights, Zimri Tapia versus Christian O'Brien. So we have two debuters coming out to close out the night here at Fighters Rep. Who's going home with the win and who's taking an L? While Zimri Tapia comes out, we'd like to shout out another one of Fighters Rep's sponsors, Freight Masters. Thank you, Freight Masters, for allowing Fighters Rep to happen. And this final fight will be at 130 pounds. Three rounds, two minutes to finish the night. A night of full of action here. So we have a Kings MMA fighter coming out right now. And if Kings, I'm sorry, that just came out. Um, Zimri Tapia, Tapia. Kings MMA guy, and if he gets a win here tonight, that's gonna give four points or more to Kings MMA, giving them the Lions Cup. The first ever Lions Cup. While Christian O'Brien comes out and gets ready, we'd like to give a shout out to Senexus Wear, another one of Fighters Rep sponsors. This is a major fight for Kings MMA right now. This fight could win them the Lions Cup. And here we go, fighter introductions. We're gonna go inside the ring to Thor. Big applause for Tapia. There's a lot of Kings MMA fans still in the house. for both fighters. We got Strong Beach in the house as well. All right, here we go with the final fight of the night. The fighters are gonna meet in the middle of the ring and then we're gonna get it going here. As we get into this final fight, we'd like to shout out f &M Logistics Corporation, another sponsor of Fighters Red. All right, and here we go to kick off the final fight of the night. Fight. As we mentioned, this fight, a win here for Kings MMA could win the Fighters or the Fighters Rep Lions Cup for Kings MMA. Let's see what happens if Tapia is able to get the W. Both guys aren't afraid to clap. Pressing the action. They're getting in and getting after, that's for sure. With as much movement as we're seeing, I'd like to see both oh, guys start throwing lower kicks, just like Ryan yeah, did. There's two low kicks. Answered right back by Tapia. His right hand. Oh, good right hand on the exit. Rogue fighter settling back in. Good movement with Tapia. Tapia's not standing still. He's moving sideways, coming in and out. And right in front. Oh, big right hand by Tapia. I think that one hurt him. Both guys' chins seem to be very high when they're stepping in. That could lead to a knockout by one fighter or the other. Oh! Slip, slip. Brian was right there on top of him once he yeah. slipped and hit the ground. You gotta have that uh, MMA background. You gotta, you gotta. Absolutely. Think. What's the pressure? Wanted to get in and get after your opponent and hurt him. Good body kick. You see, both guys probably have a lot of MMA background. By the way, they stay on their opponents once they catch a kick. Oh, or a guy goes down. Nice combination by Tapia. Good counter there. After he makes O'Brien miss the leg kick. I'd like to see both fighters start to really let their hands go a little bit more. Both guys seem to be wading in as they're throwing. If they play in their single spot, throw some strikes or power, there's gonna be a lot more power in their hands. Oh, good left. Oh, good body kick. Great first, first round to get that one to Tapia. I 100% absolutely agree with you. Tapia gets that first round. And as we mentioned, this is a big fight in terms of points for the Lions Cup. Kings MMA could run away with the Lions Cup tonight by getting this win right now.
All they need is one point. A W gets them the cup. Both guys look like they're in great shape. Absolutely, if you've been enjoying the fights tonight, click the link below, go pick up a fighter's rep shirt and help support. Looking at both fighters sitting down right now, I would say Tapia looks a little bit more fresh, a little bit more composed, and a little bit more ready to get in there and win. That doesn't mean Brian's out of this fight, but he looks like he's breathing a little bit deeper. And that Tabi is a little bit more composed. Yeah, here we go, round two of the final fight of the night. With the charge. Oh, here we go. Oh, what a leg kick by Tapia. Oh, we're gonna get a timeout here for the headgear. That was a huge leg kick by Tapia. Absolutely. Almost took Christian off of his feet. We landed it, Christian kind of turned. That's why that hook landed so crisply on uh, Brian. Oh, good body kick by Tapia. Both fighters exchange. Was a slip. I'd like to see a little bit more setup by both guys in terms of their kicking. They're both throwing some heat. If they'd like to set stuff up a little bit more, they're gonna have a little bit more success landing. Both guys are doing a much better job of moving their head though. Oh, Christian really looking for that right hand. Oh, Ryan he hits him with some power. Good knee. These boys Looking are for, banging. Oh, oh, oh what a right hand. Tapia lands on Brian. What an exchange. Oh. These boys are going at it in the last fight of the night. Yeah, I think we're going to get an official timeout and a warning for the clinch. It's that MMA background. These guys that have been doing MMA stuff for so long, it's really hard to stop clinching because it's it's just something that you've naturally done so many times. And obviously both these guys have an MMA background, it looks like, by the way that they're clinching and grabbing on each other. Let's see if he goes back to that right hand. He was looking for that right hand earlier. The way both guys are really diving in, I'd like to see a guy just step back, plant, and throw some, oh, good, throw some heat right down the middle. Each guy, when they rush in, chin is a little bit higher than Ooh. Both guys trading leg kicks. There's a slip there. We're gonna keep on going. Right, here we go. The guys start to feel each other out. Maybe the pace. Oh, good knee by Christian there. Good timing on that knee. 10 Absolutely. seconds. The way that you see both guys kind of blitzing in, Ryan's starting to get used to the timing of the blitz that Tapia is doing. He landed that knee, like you said, very well on that last attack in. You see how you can get, Tapia's getting a little bit reachy when he comes in. And that's what I'm saying. If Ryan just steps back, plants, and throws some heat, he could catch Tapia. Yeah, well-timed knee there by Christian. I would give that one to Christian. I would say it's 1-1 right now going into the third and final round. Who wants to take it? And like I said, this is a huge fight for the rankings. A win here for Kings MMA is gonna secure them the Lions Cup. We're gonna see what both fighters are made of and who really wants it more. Let's see if Kings can bring home that Lions Cup. Let's see if Christian can play spoiler tonight. Bryant looks like he's a little bit more drained going into this third round. But I would have said that going into the second as well, and he looked like the better fighter in the second round. And here we or go. At least the, maybe the fresher fighter who got the better shots landed. And here we go. Let's third, see how this third and final round goes. Final round of the final fight here at Fighters Rep 7. Fighting Prides. We have two debuters closing it out, but they have brought some excitement to the Fighters Rep ring. Oh, yeah, here we go. And there you go. Good in check. here, Bryant's coach is a little upset there that uh, Tapia held his leg. That's against the rules in Unified MMA. You can catch it and throw back immediately, but you can't hang on to it. Good check by Tapia. We got about 90 seconds left in the final bout of the evening. Who wants it more? Who's taking home the Lions Cup? I'd like to see Tapia start turning oh. up with some urgency, because yeah. this cup, Oh, good body kick by Christian. Again, a couple punches landed by Tapia, but it was off of, 
off of catching the kick. If he's able to keep up, keep continuing this attack while Bryant's in the corner, he can secure the win right now. It's anybody's fight. Oh yeah, it's a close fight for the final fight of the night here at Fighters Rep 7. Let's see if Tapia Christian goes a little back pressure. Oh, good body shot by Tapia. Break by the referee. We're back Tapia's at turning it. it up. He wants to win. He wants that cup. Let's, go. Let's see if Christian looks back for that right hand that he was landing earlier. Steps in with it. These guys are leaving it all in the ring oh, in this oh, final right fight. Hand. These two dead you guys are swinging. Here. What a way to close out the night here. Absolutely. And it's still anybody's fight. Oh, big left hand by Tapia. Tapia wants the win, though. He's definitely taking this round. Christian's gonna have to do something here soon. Here we go, 10 seconds left in the night. Let's see him bang it out. Oh. Spinning back oh. fist by Brian. Here we go, here we go. Yeah, oh, wow. what a way to finish the night, man. Absolutely, fighters rep. Fighters always bringing the excitement, throwing the hammers. What a fun fight, what a fun way to end the night here at Fighters Rep 7, a night of exciting fights, a night of finishes, and a night where somebody's gonna take home that Lions Cup. I'll be honest, I think Tapia got the win here, and that is gonna secure four points for Kings MMA, getting them the first ever Fighters Rep Lions Cup. Let's see what the official decision is. I'd like to give a quick shout out to all of Fighters Rep sponsors who make this possible, Beast Coast Unlimited, Supreme Michelada Mix, All the Optimal Wellness, Freight Masters, Cynics and Swear, and f &M Logistics Corp. And our man Fighters Rep George is in the ring with the first ever Fighters Rep Lions Cup. Let's see if Kings MMA gets the win. That's four points, and Kings MMA's taking it home. Right now, I'll tell you, that's what I think is going to happen. But what a fight that last one was. Yeah, what an exciting fight. Great way to end the night here of exciting fight. I'm excited to see who's gonna take home this cup. If you enjoyed tonight's fights, click the link below. Pick yourself up a Fighters Rep shirt. All right, and with the official decision, we're gonna send it inside the ring to Thor. the big news, who's taking DJ. home the cup? DJ! DJ. Hey knuckleheads, be sure to smash that like button, comment and share this video, and don't forget to subscribe to continue to support Fighters Rep.